All right, baby, here we go. We get ready to finish up that holiday turkey, y'all. Hey, look here. I've already made two versions of the video for my Facebook page. But anyway, this your boy, the Magnator, baby. You know, I got to use my Magnator persona right now, Facebook family, because on this camera over here, I'm making a video for the Thune House, baby. Show them how to make that Thanksgiving Day turkey. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, part of that was... The gift that keeps on giving, baby. Gift that keeps on giving. You know, when you're cooking a turkey, it's going to be some fat involved. So, this is some of the gravy from the first half that I told people on my video. It's going to have a whole lot of fat up in there, see? So, you got to strain all that fat out through the house when you're done. And this is going to be some of the gravy for the mashed potatoes if you have it, baby. You can do what you want with that, but let me get this hot pot out of the way. Put that on some giant coasters or hot pots. And then we're going to get this out of the way, too. All right, we're going to get it out of the way. So anyway, some of y'all seen this before. Y'all seen your boy. Take that turkey out the oven and all that gravy. Well, that first pan of gravy was from the first half of the cooking, baby. That's what it was from. Well, here, here we go with the second half. So now you're going to see if the turkey made more gravy as the gift that keeps on giving. Okay, so I'm going to put this on the side. Always stand back when you, know, when you open up the oven because there's a whole lot of heat coming out there right now. And when you pull your turkey out, when you use those, those aluminum pans, you want to pull the shelf out because if you pull the pan out, it might put a hole in the pan. So here we go. Grab it with strong hands and lift it up. Woo! And there you go, baby. The, the holiday turkey, it just come out. Okay, so anyway, like I told you, it's hot. So just be careful. Taking it off. I'm going to have to bring that pan back over here. Right, let's see what we got here. All right. Woo -hoo! Oh, I told you. I told you. For my, for my YouTube video fans over here, I'm going to have to bring the camera over here so y'all can see that this is the gift that keeps on giving. Just like I told you before. Let me get it on over here. Make sure I can see this. Okay, that's about as far as it's going to go. Look at all that gravy, baby. Look at all that gravy up in that, baby. I told you. I told y'all. That was a gift that keeps on giving. So let me set this camera back up. Okay. Make sure y'all can see me right. Whoa. Close the door, please. All right. Let's see. Okay. Camera set back up. All right. Here we go, baby. Now, first thing I got to do... Can y'all see that Facebook? Can y'all see that Facebook? Now this is not the kind of turkey that you can take and call with a knife, you know, because as you can see, this is breast down because the breast right now is soaking up all them juices, baby. It's soaking up all those juices, baby. That's what I like, baby. Not, not juices, but gravy, baby. More gravy, baby. So what we gotta do, we gotta bring that first pan back over here. We gotta bring that first pan back over here. And use it one more time, you know, and I thought I was done with it, but, you know, I knew I wasn't done with it. Let me put this somewhere. Let's see, let's see, let's see here. Yeah. I'll just put those fresh Louisiana shrimp. <laughs> I mean, the jambalaya, y'all. Matter of fact, two Ziploc bags of fresh Louisiana shrimp, making some jambalaya or something in that. I don't know. I might make Louisiana shrimp fry them and just put them on those King's Hawaiian rolls that we're going to be having tomorrow. See that right there, boy? Look at that. Y'all know it's gonna be a happy Thanksgiving in Val Rico, Florida, baby. That's already at 40 yesterday anyway. So anyway, put this back over here. Get down the business here. And just take one little at a time, baby. Because I gotta clear it out. Because once I start to take the turkey apart. It's going to be splashing everywhere. Therefore, I have to lower the water levels, okay? 
or rather the gravy levels. Now don't pick this up and try to tip the pan and pour the juices into a, another pan because then you might drop the pan or gravy might spill everywhere. It might just be too hot for you, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, for those of you who don't know, the reason I'm doing my YouTube page is because I'm trying to get some followers, okay? If, you can't get this recipe, but if I get like a thousand YouTube followers and Twitch followers, you know, when I retire about two and a half years, I'm going to need to make some more money, baby. So if you're following me on Twitch or Twitter or YouTube, I might give you some recipes. I will give you some recipes that will make you money off of it. I mean, come on. My, my mom ain't raised no food. You know, my daddy either. You know what I'm saying? Now, for those of you who want to base a turkey, there's no need for that with this turkey, baby. Look at all this gravy, baby. Shit, come on now. But anyway... I'm going to try to make this as quick as possible because I don't want to waste up too much of y'all time, especially y'all who I'm doing a YouTube video for on the Magnators page. Matter of fact, that's where you got to go if you want to follow me, right? You want to go to the Magnator, M-A-G-L-A-N-A-T-O-R. That's on Twitch, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, all them things, baby. Discord, Ma Ma Magnator 8078. Thanks, Lynn. Okay, come on, baby. Look at all that gravy, baby. You know you're not going to get that much gravy in your Thanksgiving meal. You might as well try to come on over here. <laughs> Woo! But anyway, baby, I see some people out there give me some shout-outs. I can't read it right now because I got to get down to business on this right here, okay? I'm going to get a big old fork out. I'm going to get some tongs out here. All right. This is the test, baby. This is the test. This turkey so darn hot, you know what I'm saying? I like to do it by hand, but it's just so hot. Well, let me see here. Nope, <sighs> gotta do it by hand. All right. I'm gonna grab this with my, with my hand. Let me see if I can get this in there like that. Maybe I can get that in there like that. Okay, let's see. And look at that, baby! Just fell right off the turkey, baby. Look at that, boy. Woohoo! Turkey leg just came right off. But it's kind of slippery for these old tongs here. Yeah? Look at that, baby. No fuss, no hassle, no stress, no strain, no pain. Just lifted that turkey leg up. Boop. It came right off the turkey, baby. That's when you know that the turkey is well seasoned, it's well cooked at the right temperature. As a matter of fact, you know what? If y'all watch, go back to my YouTube page. And watch the first video, I took that little temperature thing out the turkey. Man, I don't need that. That's for rookies, baby. I don't need something like that. So anyway, let me go on over here. I'm going to grab that second leg. Look at all the, all the backbone gone, baby. Backbone trying to come apart, baby. Just look at that. Man, look at that. Oh, the whole back, the whole back half ass silent turkey just coming off, baby. You do what I'm talking about, baby? That's what I'm talking about, baby. I'm talking about the fibers of the meat just all broken down, baby. It's all broken down, and there's only one place you can get a turkey like this. Right here. <laughs> oh, man, let me see, man. I mean, look at the, the, the bone coming out, the turkey falling apart. See, I told you, you can't take this and cut it up in one of them, uh, what do you call that, Hallmark turkeys? Watching Hallmark and Lifetime television, watching Soul Problems, baby. <laughs> that don't work here, baby. This turkey falls apart. Like I said in my first video, that's why I call it the bomb, baby. Because it's, because it's, I mean, come on, look at that. That looked like it been through some bombs, some, some, some destruction. That's what that looks like, baby. So anyway, I'm going to give y'all a, a close-up of this right here. And just, and just look at all that seasoning up in there on the inside of that turkey. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see all that seasoning up there, y'all? On the inside of that turkey. Look, ooh, look at that. Mm, mm, and there's a whole lot of seasoning. So if you want that recipe... If you want that, if you want to get close to that recipe, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what you're gonna do because I'm not gonna give it to you. Not, not right now. I mean, in the future, like I said, go through them Twitches and Twitters and stuff like that. YouTube, follow your boy Magdalena, and hey, we all gonna have a good time. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna see if I can flip this turkey over. Where's my turkey flip over? There? They're not really turkey flippers. <laughs> They're knife sharpeners, baby. I tell you, man, there's more than one use for everything, okay? Look at that. 
Oh, I better watch that because I can see that thing about to fall right apart. About to explode, baby. Mmm! Woo! Press down! Hey, look at it, baby. I'm going to do this just for you. I'm going to do this just for you. Oh, look at that piece fell on the side. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. So, anyway. I'm going to take a look at this. Look, look, look at how that breast falling apart. You know, normally the breast is the part of the, the turkey that's dry, baby. This is what I'm talking about. This is tender meat, baby. And this is what you want. You know, the people who I work with, I'm sorry that I couldn't make this for y'all for the top luck. But guess who's got good luck? And I don't even believe in luck. But you know what? I, I got it. Anyway, look at that. Look at that. Look, look, just, just falling apart. Now what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to... Oh, got a little piece, a little top there. That's okay. But what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to take this turkey apart and I'm going to put it back, the gravy back in. And then I'm going to throw it back in the oven for a little while longer so it can marinate some more. See, marination is the process of marination. And the flavors are glad to associate, baby. It's maglanate, M A G, mag, like marinate. Glad, maglanate to associate, maglanate, baby. The food of marinate and the flavors are glad to associate. That's why you gotta go and get with the maglanation process. So once I take this turkey all apart, put it in the pan, put it in the oven, 500 degrees so it can start to bubbling, so the flavors can get deep, deep in there. That's when the true magnification process is going to be at the final phase, baby. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going to go ahead and take the Twitch, the, the YouTube people, I'm going to turn them off. And then I got a biblical story to tell my YouTube friends, I mean my Facebook friends.